Hello, my name is Patrick Dean and I'm co-founder of Seminar Systems and I am co-founder as well of Sales Transformation. And I'm very glad to talk with you on this video. We're going to talk about uh, coaching and mentoring and the people in our lives. And so I want to start off this video with an admission to you. I'm one of those people that love to do it alone. I like to get the idea, execute the idea, follow it through. And I love the idea that when I've done something alone, uh, I can look at that and, and be proud of what I did. And I love the recognition as well. But as I've looked back on my life and all the important things that I've accomplished, it's always been with the help of other people in my life. As I really look at it and I get honest about it. The mentors and coaches in my life have been incredibly important. My business colleagues and associates and people that I've been on the journey with have made a huge difference. And uh, so as I look at it, I like to think that I'm a great entrepreneur and doing it alone. But in fact, it's always been about the people around me as well. So I want to talk with you about that today. Now, I know that you have goals and dreams in your life, stuff that you want to accomplish. You can ask yourself the question, what's important to you? And look at that, perhaps write that down and take a look at what is really important in your life. What do you want to accomplish? And I've, I've talked about this before, but uh, I read an article where 85% of people in their life go through their entire life without accomplishing any of the major goals in their life. I mean, I was really stunned by that uh, statistic. So you want to be in the top percentage. And one of the ways that you can be in the top percentage is find the right mentor or coach or hopefully the combination of mentor and coach, which I'm going to talk about. So I think we have some categories of people in our lives. And to put it very simply, uh, we have our friends, people we love to hang around with, people that are on the same perhaps financial level, business level that we are, people that we can really, uh, we really enjoy and share with. And then we have people in our lives who are mentors, coaches, people who, are, who have a great deal of wisdom. And those are the people we listen to. Those are the people we learn from in our lives. And then a third category of people is the people in our lives who we are going to coach or who we are going to work with or who we want to make a contribution to. So we have the contribution level of all those people in our lives that we'd like to make a contribution in their lives, perhaps be a teacher to them, a mentor them. We have the people in our lives that are friends that surround us, great people uh, that we love to be with. And we have the people of what I call the people of wisdom or people that have been there before who have studied or and have accomplished before. And I want to talk about really quickly uh, how to select a person to coach or mentor you. And I want to talk about the difference between mentoring and coaching. Now, I see coaching as a really critical part of accountability. In other words, coaching is when you get with someone and you set goals and you look forward and you do a timeline and then you're accountable for the accomplishment of that timeline. I think that's really important in any relationship where you want to uh, have some extraordinary accomplishment. Mentoring is being with a person who has been there before in the actual thing that you want to accomplish. Let's say that you have a business and you want to, uh, and it's a startup, you're an entrepreneur and you really want to get going. You want to find someone who has actually done this business and been successful before or something very similar to it. Why a mentor is so powerful from my point of view is because a mentor has Okay, has the accomplishment, as I said, but also the mentor has made the mistakes and has recovered from those mistakes. So the best thing that you can do is select somebody who has been down the road, who has had the accomplishment, who has had the challenges, who has overcome them, and who is honest enough and open enough to be willing to talk with you about that and look at your situation and be with you, as well as adding the coaching element, which is let's set some goals, let's set some time frames, let's set, let's set a timeline down and let's um, accomplish that. So 
the best thing to do is find a mentor coach. That's my point of view. And the mentor coach needs to be somebody that you can relate to, um, that, you know, there's a, there's, a, there's a kind of connection that you know happens. So you interview and you talk to people and you want to make sure that you get that connection. And it isn't a friendship connection, basically. It's a connection where there's some trust initially in the conversation and you can talk with this person and you get that they're honest. Um, I don't think that uh, finding someone who simply talks about how great they are and how much they've done and all that kind of stuff is necessarily makes a good mentor or coach. So you want to you wanna find somebody that's really willing to have an authentic conversation about themselves, what they've learned. And also, you want to find somebody that's willing, as they hold you accountable, really willing to ask the hard questions with you. This is not, again, this is not the friendship-based experience. This is an experience of a person who's willing to really get in there. Because you know that most of the stuff we have inside, inside the box, what we've accomplished already, we're going to have to do something different to get out there and to get extraordinary results. And that takes a very skilled mentor coach for you that can ask those questions and work with you through what has held us back. My greatest mentor, mentors and coaches are people that have asked some very challenging questions of me and kept asking until I worked through and got to the other side of that. And so that's what I encourage you to do. Find a mentor, a coach, somebody that you really resonate excuse me, resonate with and somebody who is willing to ask you the hard questions and somebody who has been there before. They have had failures and they have had successes and they are willing to really share that with you. Have somebody that's um, authentic and, uh, and holds you accountable. And when you find that person, uh, that's the person that you want to stick with. And be with. And when you're working with a mentor, you want to set a time frame down that you're going to do the work. This is not really open ended forever. And so you want to look at the time frame that you're going to be working with this mentor and um, set that into motion. So money you spend on a mentor or coach is really money well spent. You're just putting it in your bank account because. You're putting it in, if you put it into action, well, there's a caveat, of course, you've got to put it into action, but a mentor or coach is not going to allow you to slide on that. You want to put that into action and you might as well pay yourself because I think it's the greatest investment you can make. You pay a mentor or coach and you're going to get extraordinary or uh, amazing results from that. So be good at choice. Now, the last thing is when you bring yourself to the game of being coached and mentored, be open to being coached and mentored. Be willing to, uh, be willing to, you know, be open with what's important to you, and be willing to risk, and be willing to really look at changing some of your behaviors, changing the way that you're doing things. Be open and excited to something new. Bring yourself to the game. In other words, prepare yourself for something completely new, maybe something you're not going to be good at uh, right away, but it'll be a practice. So anyway, thanks for watching this video. I hope you find the right person for you because uh, it will accelerate you tremendously. It's a time saver in a major way to have a great mentor and coach, something that you accomplished in five years with a great mentor or coach you can accomplish in six months in, or, or a shorter time. So thanks a lot and find the right person.